Alright, so today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your iPhone. Um, first thing you're going to do is download this program called QuickPone. Um, I will have a link for that in the description. Uh, Alright, so you want to connect your iPhone. And uh, just go ahead and let that go. Hit next. Um, it's going to find the firmware for you. Uh, as soon as it finds that, you can go ahead and hit next. Um, you want to replace your boot logo. Hit next. Hit next. Alright, so you're going to want to put your phone in recovery mode. To do that, you hold the power and the home button until it shuts off. You hold it for 15 seconds. So. Alright, it should reboot. Um, you won't have the pineapple yet. Once you do that, uh, it's going to take longer for me because this is already jailbroken. Um, you'll get a message saying that uh, you did it wrong. You just hit OK and do it again and it will jailbreak it. Should we fast forward through this? No, they can. You guys could probably fast forward through this if you want. We'll just sit here and admire the pineapple. Okay, so it's telling me that uh, I did this wrong. So you just hit OK. Uh, Alright. Just hit Next. And wait. It did that by itself. It says surprise in some stupid language. Get ready for these directions. Hold home for five seconds. Hold home and power for ten seconds. Don't let go of the home button. And hold the home button for thirty seconds. It usually does it within like ten seconds or so. Alright, nine seconds. Alright, and then you can let go. You should get a white screen. What you just did is you just put your iPhone in DFU mode. You just give it a second. They can fast forward through this too. I don't feel like we need to edit this for them. Right. I wouldn't even know how. You wouldn't know how? No. Nope. I would know how. It's not that difficult. It's just... uh, Final Cut, dude. It's hard. Final Cut? Well, I can imagine it wouldn't be hard to find out. It's probably something that tells you. Alright, um, the pointage process appears to have been completed successfully. So, your iPhone will reboot. You'll have a new boot logo. And you'll have these two programs called Cydia and Installer. You can check out uh, my other video which tells you how to get uh, a program that will let you download almost any app for free. Uh, a couple of the apps they don't have, but the majority of them you can get for free. Uh, we'll just let this go. You can fast forward if you want. How long has it been recording for? 4 minutes and 53 seconds. Uh,
It'll only have to do this once. It's uh, pretty much like if you've ever restored your iPod or your iPhone, it's almost the same thing. It's just telling you what's going on right now. And you get a nice little fancy pineapple. Alright, so your boot logo is now changed to the pineapple. With other programs to jailbreak it, you can uh, get different boot logos. You could probably mess around with some settings and get a different boot logo than this, but I'm fine with this one. Yeah, you're fine with it. It's my phone. <laughs> First thing which when the first thing you want to do after you uh, jailbreak, you're going to be given these two apps, Installer and Cydia. First thing you're going to want to do is go into Cydia and look for a program called Winterboard. Um, and after you download that, you're going to want to get one called SB Settings. And uh, everything's explained from there. Alright.